Uh, we can do a dark oh, mystery. Uh, Mike Mazowski. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Alright, yeah, since we're here, we might as well just go revent. We should respawn. Mike Mazowski. You have some paperwork to do. Yeah, yeah, something but, around that. But it's a little bit lower voice, too. Did you know snails are born from eggs? Yeah. No, you didn't. That's some bullcrap. Think about this. Know that. Mal, think about it this way. Snakes. What? No, uh, snakes correction. No, snakes. hold on. Correction. Correction. What are snails? Slimy paw slugs. The shells. <laughs> Mal, what type of what type are what type are they? Are they amphibian? Are they reptilian? Know. Are they mammals? I thought they were amphibians. Okay. If they're amphibians, what could that classify? What types of bro what type of boring process can amphibians go through? Some of them can go through live birth. I don't know what I was thinking. To be honest, with now I don't know. I didn't. Know, I, I didn't. I thought they, I, I honestly have no clue how how you made more snails. How do you have more snails? I don't know. I don't know they lay <laughs> eggs. They just. It just seems so slimy and like anthropomorphous, right? Where would. How, how can that then turn out? How can a woman snail create then an egg, right, you know? It's almost kind of like you have to be solid <laughs> to. <laughs> a woman snail, by the looks of things, should not be given birth to an egg! How do you. How does a woman snail. <laughs> I was like, I'm trying to naive, you're trying to make it. <laughs> when a mommy snail and a daddy snail love each other very much. That's not what I'm trying to say. I'm saying, how can. Okay, you're going from a slimy thing to a shell to another slimy thing. I'm like. <laughs> Ma, um, Mal, look at tadpoles. Look at frogs, for example. Tadpoles Cri are different. Tadpoles are. Correction! Look so at seahorses. Seahorses are. Awesome. The male so is the one that gives Thanks. birth. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Quit with your feminist stuff. Quit with your feminist <laughs> propaganda. This is what people have to deal with. Either we're really high, or we deal with mommy snails and daddy snails. <laughs> no, 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 no. My other group is high. Oh, oh, that yeah, good. yeah. It was a, it was a pretty interesting one. Let's just say he was a little bit over high, and uh, he was still somewhat high the next oh. day. Listen, okay, I honestly Got it. have never given the slightest thought on how more snails get into the world. You know, oh, well, <laughs> I just give it to the world. I don't have to do this. Oh my Until god! I just gave a video of an animal being hatched from an egg. I'm like, wait a second, how does that work? Snails make eggs? What? Oh, hold on. I want to check this. What type of snail? What snails are? While you uh, go get us our uh, story mission together. I mean, they're they're mm. amphibians, I think. So, so like, what does that do? What does that do? You better get off my chest, you piece of crap. I guess, I guess I just always thought snails appear out of thin air? Well, they are That's mollusks. I forgot they were mollusks. Are, let's see, that's something I'm like. You know funny? I taught a little kid class about these kinds of things. Did you teach me about mommy to snail and daddy snail? <laughs> So yeah, they're gastropods. I know what that means. Yeah, they're uh, gastropods and uh, mollusks. Most gastropods. So it's perfectly normal for them to lay eggs?
Oh, yeah, I forgot. I, we didn't do that public event. Hold on. Well, let's look at what gastropods are, because I think I, I, I don't, it's kind of hard for me to explain them. That's not what I want. Is this on Reddit spot there? Showing me how a snail was born, and it's just they pop out of these eggs. They how do you pop out of an egg if you're a snail, right? You, you're anthropomorphic. <laughs> well, you, I mean, caterpillars most, eat through their sh uh, shells. Yeah, but what what does a snail do? Such okay, so a mollusk of a large class gastropod, such as snails, slugs, or whelks, or whatever they're called are commonly known as they belong to a large taxonomic class of interbrays within the phylum mollusk called gastropods. Okay. I follow you. You're right on time. Wouldn't miss it. Can't miss it more likely. Say hi to the scorn for Oh, somebody wasn't the you weren't the first one to ask this question. Oh, thank goodness. Yep. Aquatic <laughs> gastropods generally deposit their eggs in gelatinous masses that are attached to hard surfaces. Our uh, extra branch lays a huge number of fertilized eggs. By contrast, land snails lay eggs only two to three times per season, with eggs no with egg numbers per clutch um, ranging from a few dozen to more than a hundred. Hey, what so you're about there? There's a hundred baby snails pop around eggs. <laughs> you want me to? There's the uh, somebody. There's also the thing of gastropods reproductive behavior that we can look up. I'm good, man. <laughs> Hold on, here you go. Do gastropods reproduce nah, sexually or already. asexually? So the hermaphrodite species may for self fertilize at. Hold on. Yeah, because it says species might self fertilize at times and sexual leave fertilized eggs at we other times so are able to change sex when needed some sne snail p species reproduce only through male and female sexual activities while others reproduce only asexually or asexually when needed and sexually at other times you go so basically they're pretty flexible <laughs> yeah they're pretty much every type of sexuality exists in one animal Consistently. This only needs that they need to survive. Maybe that's why they were able to survive this way for so long. They're not picky. Yeah, but other species can do that for. They're not picky. Other species, but other species could do that just as easy, and it's through sexual reproduction. Yeah, but they said, but they, they think of it this way: What happens if you have a rate? What happens if your species is low on numbers of a certain gender? Would I can you... make an insane human joke, but I won't. <laughs> I know. That's what I'm saying this is... This is feminist propaganda at its highest. No snails are feminist then? Is that what you say? Feminist snails? I don't snails? know if you want a snail to be your champion of women's rights. I'm just saying. You might, wanna, <laughs> you, you might be better off. I'm just saying. I just I love it when you're just wobbling around in your little outfit. And it looks, literally makes you look like a bit like a snail. <gasps> Mal, I need you to change your chest plate to brown. And then no. you can officially look like a snail. No. <laughs> Why? Why not? I don't wanna be a snail. <laughs> Snails are amazing creatures. I don't know what you're talking about. Gross. Except when it comes to salt. Thunder. Thunder, it's not so See, good. I constantly since I kept on hearing that when I was a kid, I'm like, that's gotta be a myth. No. Right? I checked it out years ago. Poor thing. It looked. I was In actually. Person? I actually I felt depressed. I actually felt. You know what? This is actually. I feel really bad for the snail. And I also thought it was really cool at the same time. But yeah, I felt Mommy, really bad. I killed the snail. What'd you do? I poured table salt on it. <laughs> yep. It's, uh, they bubble. Literally bubble. Uh, oh. Yeah. It's like a. It's like a. It's like a. Uh, it's like cool. a table. It's like a baking soda in water. Except on skin. I was thinking, I was just thinking, hydrogen, I was thinking of... Don't touch him, don't touch him. You peroxide. touch him, I'll hurt you. I was thinking of hydrogen peroxide. Okay, go, go my ghost. Go, be free. Attack this mass murdering you maniac. Seen, have you ever seen what hydrogen peroxide does to the blood? Yes. In blood? That's what I thought. 
Oh, whatever I heard about the snails. Poor snails. That, but it makes sense, I guess, because of what table the salt is. But it's that's the case. Then, if that's the case, I wonder what makes them what the mollusks and other have that are living in the seawater. With salt. I'm pretty sure they have some sort of resistance skin covering thingy. Yeah, probably like an external skin thingy. Yeah. They don't have a. Hey, you want to know a fun fact? What? Do you know what NA is? NA. No, uh, NA is sodium. Uh, Narcotics Anonymous? No. No. NA is sodium, and it's very poisonous yeah. to humans. Yeah. Do you want to know what CL is? CL that... is chlorine, which is also very poisonous to humans. Yeah. That's why they said don't drink chlorine. Do you want to know what chlorine. happens when you put them together? Table salt. Yeah. Well, I mean, think of it this way. Hydrogen and oxygen making a liquid. Hey, that's... To be fair, that's pretty abnormal. Nobody... Like, in nature, things just don't randomly come together to make hydrogen and oxygen, right? Yeah. That's not likely at but, all. Yeah, but it's, think of it, it like a two gas item, two gas elements becomes a liquid. Well, if you cool it down, it becomes a liquid. You can have oxygen liquid and you can have hydrogen liquid. Cool it down enough. Yeah, but it, after a while it becomes solid. Yes, but if you keep it at constant temperature, it could. No, it could but it, Yeah, I get what you're saying. Like, I get what yeah. you're saying. So, like, that type of stuff is like. It's very. It's like. It's like. It's like, a, that's like snails. They're able to be all three classes when they want to be. I can. Uh, yes, Hark. Snails are just the biggest champion of women's rights ever. <laughs> you mean SCW's rights? Just, just gonna point that part out. Just no, 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 no. Women's rights. Why women? Just that would be seahorses. Women's rights are the most important. That would be seahorses. That would be seahorses. Because oh, men can work at That's home too. <laughs> what? Men work at home all the time. It's just that. I know, I was just joking about. <laughs> I know. Sure. Oh my god. <laughs> I love it. That How are you sucks. doing, Insomnia? Are you being sexist? Like Arius? <laughs> I don't know why people call me sexist all the time. I just want women to always stay in the home. Well, then you should be, not be a seahorse then. But you didn't let me finish my statement. I want men to stay at home as well. So you, want want to to so, you, so you just want them to be snails? No, I just don't want to go outside. So you want them to be snails? Imagine saying that first part in a conversation with somebody in the university. <laughs> like, I want all women to stay at home. And they're like, how dare you? Wait, let me finish. I, I want all men to stay at home as well. I just... Uh, but the problem with it is that you have to have a decent amount of sunlight, or your body, is, your skin will have a, a problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mal, don't, you Kyle, can... don't lecture me about my lack of vitamin D. Hey, I'm not one to talk. Actually, I've been out quite a bit, but I'm still like super pale. I've been pretty consistently going to the gym, and I'm very happy. Are you cute with me it. right now, Mal? Are you really cute with me? Things I do. This is what I get for flexing. Uh, it's flexing women's rights? I am a champion of women's rights. I don't know what anybody says. You're a white they knight? They call me... I... <laughs> I take everything back. Bye. Or I could be, I could be like one of those... I could be like one of those... Those gentlemen with the dapper hats and be like, my lady. Oh my days. Revive me now. Don't sit. Thank you. How do we get up there? No, just stick at the entrance and I got this. Okay. No, I meant like the actual entrance. Oh. Never mind, I already I already figured out how to get there though. I was wondering how long it was gonna take you to figure that one out. You know what? You were following me? No, yeah, I knew where it was. I was had a res you died, remember? 
excuses. Mm hmm. Go kill the wizards already. Hurry. Don't worry about Don't these tell guys. Yeah, you your ghost is useless. Your ghost is unable to shoot for you. I don't need my ghost to shoot for me. My kneecaps do all the damage I require. Yeah, but I, let's... I, I, it includes effort. Why would I want my ghost to be outside the safety zone of my head? You mean your backpack? We don't have a backpack. Well, uh, guess what? Failsafe says otherwise. And so does Ghost. You know what? What does Failsafe know? She's been <gasps> I got it! killing lanterns. I got it! What'd you get? The What'd sparrow! You get? I got the sparrow. <sighs> I just need Nightfall. <sighs> Mel? Mel, you okay there, buddy? You okay there? You, uh, wanna talk about it? Mel? Wanna talk about it? Buddy? Friend? Mel? You okay there? <laughs> Here, let me show you something. This will make you feel better. Nothing can make me feel better. Hold on, don't talk so bad low about that. Here, I got this something for you. All right, now come over here. Oh well, now come what? Over, come over here. Now what? Come over here. What do you want? Here. Oh. Here. One sec. Come on, give me a hug. We'll be sure I bed. Nah, I'm fine. Okay. Hey, Mel. Okay, I need to show you one thing then. Is it that? Oh crap. Mel. Mel. Yes. Yes. We have to. Uh, we have to go to the public event. But check this out. Ta da! Like my sparrow. Stop somebody's eye up with that. Hey, my sparrow. <laughs> I'm gonna stab someone. 